Welcome to the sewing tutorial of this beautiful dress that we've drafted in the previous video. Now this is the outcome of what I sewed using a miniature dress form and this is the back side of it. So the difference is that it does not have a sleeve. So let's get right. Now I've cut the different pieces that we have on our fabric. We have the upper part and lower part of the back and the front. Now this is the skirt for the back. And this is the skirt for the front together with the upper part. So according to how we marked our lines, that is how it was cut. Cutting our black fabric and our white fabric. This is on fold. You can see it how it is too. And this is the other side. You can put a balance mark so that you know where each one is going to meet. Now to join this, we are going to join this back separate. And then we are going to join the front. The front part is cut on fold just the cf and then this is the upper part other parts too are cut on fold okay that is double at once so like i said we are going to sew the back skirt separate join the front skirt separate and then put the two of them together so make a notch for the dart intake at the back side so that you'll be able to notice where you're going to be sewing your dart and this is the color which comes after we have finished joining the back and the front shoulders together. Okay, so let's go and join the skirt and we'll bring it back to see the outcome of what it looks like. Mm. Okay, so this is it. Now while joining this, you have to make sure that the white patches match together both front and back. This is the upper part, just the normal way of joining the armhole um, princess that you can see how beautiful it is. And then this is the back, we've not joined it together to the front, it is still on its own. So before joining to the back, we're going to join our white yoke, um, shoulder yoke cut out, okay? So... I'm going to get it now so that the shoulders for the front will be complete before we join to the back. So here they are. Because this is a miniature, the cutout at the shoulder is not deep. If it is on a bigger fabric, try and make it deep. Okay? Or at your desired length. Now this is it for this part and this is for this part. Now to join it, this is how we are going to join it from the lower part. So to one end of the shoulder and then from the lower part also on the other side we sew to the other end of the shoulders and if we turn it it's going to be beautiful. You have to be very careful when sewing it so that it does not squeeze. Okay so that is what I'm going to be joining now before joining it to the back side. Right so this is what we have. I've joined it and I've joined the back side also and then the shoulders we're just going to put it even though it has opening at the front we're just going to join the shoulders the back and front together now if, if it's a bigger fabric we're going to finish up this white part first before joining it okay so that it looks beautiful if not it will be difficult for us to use lining and turn it so we just finish it and attach okay it will make it easier for you to finish it up or if you have your lining you can still use your lining to turn it very well okay but I prefer to finish it up before attaching it to the shoulders now after which we've joined the shoulders we're going to join the collar starting from the midpoint down to the v neck line at the back this is the process that i'm showing you so that you'll be able to know how to go about it i believe that with this um, clips you'll be able to know how to go about this design and come out with something very beautiful watch the previous video on the drafting and then watch the sewing part and of course you're going to do a very good job so for the color we'll finish one part first but then whatever that is remaining will not join it to the neckline using the measurement yes we'll finish the edges first and then join the remaining parts to the neckline 
and this is the outcome of what we have this is the back side the collar looking through the mirror and this is the front part looking so beautiful thank you for watching